after the tragic loss of a teammate and friend, the Portage Lake Pioneers came together to make their season memorable. Winning the Gibson Cup last weekend has taken the team to the championships beginning tomorrow. TV6's Houghton Hancock Bureau reporter Sarah Blakely spoke with the team about their journey through the season. We skated with him down here at the D Stadium that night and found out at like 9.30 p.m. what had happened. On Friday, January 4th, Portage Lake Pioneers forward Roger Lewis was in a fatal snowmobile accident in Franklin Township, not far from D Stadium. Devastated by Lewis's sudden passing, the Pioneers lean on one another for support. I'd say the first two games after our good friend and teammate Roger Lewis passed away were pretty emotional for all of us. The Pioneers say he was more than just a teammate. He was family. He was awesome. He was so nice all the time. He always had a smile on his face. He always was just super happy. He could always cheer you up no matter what. And he definitely is missed in the locker room and on the ice too, obviously. When you have teammates like we do have, we're all brothers and we're all family, so we all pull together and this is how we get through things like this. Skating their way through an emotional season, the Pioneers made up for their last few seasons by winning the coveted Gibson Cup last weekend and making their way to the championship. Everyone could have easily just fell apart, but we stuck up for each other and it showed during our season considering we finished our season with a 19-4 and record. In making it to the championship wasn't easy, but they have a newfound strength to end the season on a high note. Mostly we're looking forward to uh, just playing hard and playing for Roger's memory once again and doing it again. It's good to get it done for Roger and have a pretty good season for him, I think, so it's pretty special. The Pioneers play in Eagle River tomorrow at noon against the Fond du Lac Bears in their first game of the championship. Sarah Blakely, TV6 News, Houghton. What a great story, and good luck to the team. I'll be rooting for you guys.